the world opens. A storm of political and uh, social disarray. Okay, there's a revolution happening. All right, there's a coup. The governor and his wife. Um, I, damn it, I can start over. The governor has been beheaded. The governor's wife escapes. In her interest to preserve herself, she leaves her newborn child. The people go crazy. Uh, in this mess, we meet uh, Grusha. And one of the servants um, takes this child. She goes on a long journey with this child. And she goes through this thing. And she has to cross a deathly bridge. She almost loses her life and the child's life. And then, boom, you go back to one. And now you do the whole thing from the point of view of the singer slash Aztec. A crazy, drunk, revolutionary, we'll call him, somehow finds himself in this position of judge and has to decide who should get that child. Because the governor's wife comes back and claims the child because the child is tied to the estate. She can't do anything without that child. The chalk circle test and places the child in the middle and the mother who is able to pull the child out of the circle is deemed the actual mother. Is it the mother who raised the child or is it the biological mother? And that's the big climax of the show. And there's a lot of stuff that happens in between. It really teeters and totters between tragedy and sublime comedy.